Yo everyone, it's Andrew Chio Ogwen. So, welcome back to the channel where today, of course, we have another Boruto discussion for the most part. Um, of course, this is going to be my last one before the release of Boruto Manga Chapter 36, which should be releasing uh, on either tomorrow or Sunday. So, yeah, it's definitely that. I'm recording this on Friday. Well, <laughs> Well, it's basically Friday, it's like basically after 1, uh, well, after 12 in the morning, quote unquote. <laughs> um, so yeah, I think I've done enough of the in-between discussions leading up to chapter 36. But funny enough, um, this video has nothing to really do with the immediate plot um, of the story going forward. More so, I wanted to take the time to really talk about the character of Borta Uzumaki, you know, the main character, the character, the name on the title card. Um, and basically just compare it with Naruto Uzumaki for the long run and just my predictions in terms of how Boruto's character arc will unfold towards the end. Nothing too crazy, just a little quickie, <laughs> I suppose. But yeah, but be sure to rate, comment, subscribe, shout out to the new subscribers of course and I really appreciate all the support I've been getting. Um, yeah, almost at 200 subs so you know, help a nigga out. But anyway. So I've been thinking about it since yesterday, giving it some thought, and I've been comparing Boruto to Naruto and their character arc, or at least what Boruto has to even compare to Naruto to so far. Now, I was thinking about it that for the most part, most persons would agree that they don't, it's either they don't really like Boruto Uzumaki, they think he's an okay character, he's a spoiled brat, one of the following really. Now, in my personal opinion, his character has improved, um, especially for the manga, not too drastic for the anime. But ever since the events of Boruto Naruto movie, the retelling in the manga and afterwards, his character has he's seen some development. I'm not gonna lie, but for the most part, he hasn't really wowed me. Yeah, he, he's like an okay plus in my book for the most part. Um, but when I thought about it and really compared him to Naruto, I kind of I was wondering what was that intentional for him to be written this way and it seems like that is the case and if I'm making a prediction on it it would seem that Borto is going to do like a have a reverse character arc when compared to Naruto what I mean by that is that at the start of Naruto he was an outcast a loser he was at the bottom of the barrel and you know the underdog so to speak and we related with him, we could relate with him. He was built up um, towards the end of Shippuden where his character was arguably or debatably, you know, tarnished in a sense with the whole, you know, child of prophecy, all of that. But for the most part, he, he, he started at zero and went up. Boruto is the reverse of that. He has everything at the start of the series. And I'm pretty sure a lot of people would have already mentioned this or made note of it and said it in their own videos. But it would seem like the turning point for us, the audience, to actually appreciate and respect our just overall just rate Boruto as a character will be when it comes to that point when he loses everything and just seeing how he reacts in that situation. It seems like we're going down that path where, as I mentioned, we're doing a reverse. So we start with Boruto having everything. But if I feel like it's going to come to a point where he definitely loses a lot. And that's been foreshadowed ever since like the end of the Momoshiki um, the fight with Momoshiki. And I wouldn't be surprised if it actually does turn out like that. And that's going to be interesting, I'm not going to lie, to see that we only get a decent appreciation for the main character towards the, well, it could be the end, but near, at least probably midway or near to the end of the series for the most part. Um, and until then, he just remains and, you know, he's okay, he's okay, plus, eh, not really feeling him, the main character should be somebody else, you know, those type of comments. And I just find it pretty funny, funny and amusing, I'm not gonna lie. But, yeah, let me know what you guys think about that, for the most part. Um, do you agree that Borto seems to have, seems to be having, a, like, a reverse character arc, um, when compared to Naruto, his dad? Um, I wouldn't be surprised if, you know, a lot of people agree, but 
Yeah, it does seem like that's going to be the case. And honestly, I'm interested in seeing when and if that time comes because right now I don't think not. Oh well, I don't think Boruto Uzumaki is getting the love Naruto had like a hundred and so episodes in. So, <laughs> yeah, I mean, you have people through things like Sarada should have been the main character. So, I don't think I'm too far off in this little discussion or a little prediction of mine in terms of how Boruto's character arc will eventually unfold. But let me know what you guys think. Um, of course, as I said, this is my last discussion before the release of Boruto Manga Chapter 36. I It's going to be a busy weekend for me for the most part. I'll be up and down on the road. But I'm hoping that you guys, you know, I'm just hoping you guys stay tuned. You know, check out my review when I post it. I want to try and mix it up. I might do a slight live reaction at the beginning probably so look out for that i want to kind of start mixing it up i suppose for you guys and just have a discussion with you guys about the chapter when it drops so i believe there are some spoilers out some leaks but yeah i'm not gonna cover those here i'll wait for the chapter so rate comment subscribe and i'll definitely see you guys in the next one well boruto manga chapter 36 see you guys there